Hello and welcome back. Um, I don't know. I think I'm gonna call this like grunge to glamour or something like that. I'm not sure yet, so I don't have an intro for us. But welcome back. We are here with Ella, and she just got home from work in the morning, and she's about to head to school. Um, and she is a B student currently. She still wants to do very good in school, even though she is pregnant. She's brushing her teeth and going to go cry it out in bed before school. Oh, didn't make it. Didn't make it. Our beautiful girl, so sad. And just disappeared into thin air. So we have the bedroom. Um, pretty much cleaned up but it's very bare she's going to be giving birth at any time and we are not prepared for this child i do have the realistic um childbirth mod but we don't really have anybody to take with us um so ravi um did come over and help us with birthday money I'm wondering if we should kind of do a storyline where Ravi so what I did was I randomly um, used MCC command center to randomly select a couple of sims for her to have relationships with it's not very realistic and I have started many 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 a series in the past without really caring about this but it's not realistic for a sim to be a teenager and not know a single solitary soul and now remember, Ella's father died in a fire, and her mom was never around. She doesn't even know who her mom was. But when her dad died, she found out that her mom had left her this house. Um, so maybe we can do a little storyline where Ravi is, because he's an adult, so he's significantly older than her, where Ravi kind of takes over almost like a father role for her. Um, it's night on the town, so, you know, maybe her and Ravi can go do something she can tell him about her pregnancy um and maybe uh, performance loss of course you know maybe she can ask him to go to the birth with her if she makes it without going into labor um so that she at least has somebody with her um she might come directly home from school and be having this baby so she's craving sweet food so yeah Ravi stopped by um we did ask him for the birthday money but you know um my ex has been texting me a lot saying that they want me back we ended on really bad terms but I still care about them I'm not who is that is that forest um you have a spouse I have a bad relationship with whoever this is. Interesting. Yeah, so I think Ravi and Matthew are kind of like her dad's friends. Um, and then their kids are, are a fair bit younger than Ella is. Um, and her dad, he was so handsome. He's unfortunately gone. So Christine is a teen. Maybe we could be friends with her. And so is Lucia. They're both teens. Um, of course, we have a hairy dog that's just making our house even more messy. <laughs> As we're trying to clean it up. That's rad. Quit stopping. I want to speed through the day. We're taking way too much time. Uh-oh. Very tense. Unwanted pregnancy. This pregnancy will be over soon. It's much too late to consider stopping it. She has to go through with it now, and who knows how she will make it all work. She'll have to somehow because the baby is coming for her sure. And she's still upset about the breakup. You know, she could have stayed with him, but I don't think he would have been around. Ravi! Yes, Ra Oh my gosh. So he just brought himself over. Hello. That is so sweet, Ravi. 
Robbie, Robbie, Robbie. Oh. There he is. Perfect. Oh my gosh. Let's give him keys. He's going to be like daddy o for us. Hurry up before you go on labor. Go. Give him the keys. And then no we're going to travel before we go into labor. Ravi. Aw, Ravi. You're so, so kind. And you know, if, if he was close to her dad, he's going. he's got to know what she's going through. And let's just pretend like he can't tell that she's pregnant. <laughs> I mean, with the mods I have, she does not look very pregnant at all. Um, where should we go? I don't really remember what is in this world, but usually we have restaurants in Newcrest. Sasabune? But remember, I have to freaking pay. Mean vibe. Yeah, let's check a diner. That seems more low-key, because I have to pay for this, which is stupid. Especially if Robbie's supposed to be like... Maybe I'll ask him for money again. <laughs> I kind of, I do like when they, the stories do kind of write themselves. He came over twice of his own account. He did call first um, and ask her, but he did come over twice on his own. And that just kind of gave me the idea. We are going to save the game because these restaurants oh God, are usually just ridiculous. Oh, I don't have to pay. Duh, it's night on the town. I'm so stupid. Girl, get in here and get yourself something delicious because it's free. And make it fast because you're going to literally burst at any time. Robbie's like drunk or sick or something. Ask for advice. <gasps> How cute. Oh my god. Sad mood swing from pregnancy. The slightest little things are making Ella want to cry. Can she ask someone she's not, like, romantically involved with to be $50? What? Since when is it $50 to freaking be seated? It's supposed to be a low-key diner situation. Okay, well, we might just ask him out here because we're going to end up in labor like any second probably um okay tell about being pregnant and single ah so so <laughs> ravi you know i don't have my dad oh and now we're being seated are you really gonna take 50 dollars from me because i will cry you know I lost my dad and I don't really have anybody and I'm single and I'm pregnant. Okay, um Oh shoot. I haven't even called the So where is that? Okay. You have to forgive me because this mod is new to me. I've used it one time and I did not do it correctly. So she needs to call them now before she goes into labor. She's not going to be able to do the birth. All right, stop chatting. Make the freaking phone call. This game, she can walk and talk on the phone at the same time. Like that's, she can do that. She should be able to do that. Do you remember when that was not a part of The Sims? You could not multitask at all. Choosing the right birth method for you and your baby can be a daunting task. There are so many different options. It can be easy to get lost in the medical jargon. We're going to do a natural delivery. Natural, natural delivery is a low-tech way of giving birth by letting nature take its course. We travel to the hospital once you are in early stage labor. Early labor can be unpredictable. The average length varies from hours to days. To promote comfort during early labor, you may try exercising on a birthing ball or take a walk. After you're fully dilated, you'll be instructed by your obstetrician to start pushing. The stage typically lasts about 70 minutes. Once your baby's born, they'll be handed to you immediately for scan to scan contact. Yep, we're going to do that. Okay, now we should be able to ask him. Where's our freaking table? Where's our green 
Okay, get over here and sit. Sit. You know, Robbie, I appreciate that you are doing all of this for me and um oh, it's gonna be so hard to find in here. Yes, ask him. I hope this works, because she can't do this by herself. Robbie, you know, I don't have my dad, and I really don't want to give birth by myself. Would you mind coming? Sure. Did he say yes? Oh! <gasps> Did he say no? That did not look promising. Oh, oh no. Oh no. I think he said no. She's going to be by herself. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's have root bear floats. Why not? It's free. Um, let's just get the same thing. Lena Oh, oh, God. God. Oh, I hope he did. too sad to do this. Did he say no? Infamous club. I'm not having a partner. It's hard to tell another son about not having a serious romantic partner all the while being pregnant. Like... Aw, if me being there will make it easier for you, then count me in. <laughs> do we do we want to give Robbie a makeover? I think we should give him a makeover. Let's ask him some cool things about himself while we're waiting for our food. Ask him for reassurance. You know, I love this because, you know, most likely there's going to be somebody that you can reach out to in a situation like this. Um, and if he was dad's bestie, you know, he's not going to let this poor girl. You're not having a water balloon. You're, you're, okay, go pee. You're, you're off to have a water balloon fight when you're about to piss your pants and pass out. You should have got a coffee. Oh my gosh, does this not just sum up, like, what she's... Where is she? Cool. In the bathroom. That face, like... <laughs> oh my gosh. And she is so freaking tired. She's gonna end up passing out. Alright, come on. We have, like, limited time. Oh, bad, bad mood you guys are in. <laughs> oh, look at her. <laughs> Just look at how sad she is. Oh, honey. I feel so bad for you. <laughs> like... This poor, poor baby. Really, really a poor, poor thing. Oh, you are gorgeous, though. Tired. The baby isn't even here yet, and she can't even. Yeah, we might be leaving this joint without our food because she's tired. Uh oh oh, Mustilavoya. Oh, what bead? 
Express your feelings. Maybe this will help her accept. Oh, can she ask him to go? Oh, to an abortion. Well, I'm pregnant. <laughs> He's like, I can't tell you that it's all going to be okay. Because it's going to be really, really hard. But let me make some calls for you and see if I can get a contractor out to help you with the house. We'll see if we can make it a little more safe for your baby. And the food is here when she's about to completely pass out. Do you think that I can cook? Ask about Woohoo. Um, little, little bit late on that one. Find out if he has children. Complain about your problems. Eat your food. Of course I do. I think she can cook. And there's the pass out. Perfect. Robbie's just like, what have I gotten myself into? Girl is passed out at dinner. You know? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that is... That is... That sums up the whole thing. The whole thing. Okay, eat your food, because... Get that out of the way. And then you can go home. We have somebody in our corner, baby girl. I mean, isn't that wonderful? We do... Let's ask him for money. Three dollars? Ravi, honey, that was a little rude. That was a little bit rude. I know it's high charisma, you can ask for a loan, but um, let's have a deep conversation about the baby. Call a stranger. Why would you call a stranger? Would you finish the food? Pyro pickles? Does she actually need this person? Because I don't think she did. Alright, go home. Thank Ravi for all of his help. You're not in labor yet, which shocks me. Big time shocks me. So we're going to go to sleep. Boring discussion. I'm talking on the phone. She didn't like that guy very, that pyro guy very much. Alright. Now truly, before she does... Um, Let's figure out exactly um, how we're going to. I guess I could get these out of the way here. Um, I think this would probably go better here. Um, we are so broke. So 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 broke. An end table. Hundred, there goes all our money. I mean, it's not ideal. Um, Oh, cool. We have se What? We have a cow and chickens in our inventory from the lot somehow?
All right, that gives us a little bit of a cushion here. Let's get a end table for our bed. Um, perfect groovy. We can say that that contractor that Robbie recommended built that out of some of the scrap wood that she has hanging around the house. Perfect. We really don't need anything else. Um, I do have bust the dust on and it's good to know that the house now looks worse than it did when we moved into it. Um, but <laughs> um, Let's see, how much money do we need to get like 350? We're so close. Let's sell another seed packet. That way we can, oh, I always do, I always freaking do that. Um, where do we want to put this bad boy? I guess it could go in here so that she's with the baby. Um, the baby's here. But right now, she needs to go to sleep because she's wasted. Alright, any second she's probably going to wake up in labor. Um, it's been like 24 hours now since she... Try, change it into the third. I knew it. Change it into the third trimester. Okay, so uh, that was does he just come with me? I haven't done this with somebody who is. Um, not in the household. I can actually take him with me. I don't know if he'll actually like interact with her on his own accord. Like I said, I've never tried it with a sim I'm not controlling. I could add him to the family temporarily for the story. Maybe we'll do that. We are here. <laughs> We are here. We are here. Um, with this mod, the birth can take quite a while um, until she is dilated enough. Um, try doing some labor-inducing activities. You will go into active labor once you are 10 centimeters. Um, this is Robbie, right? It looks different. And I have headline effect. Did I just say remove from family? He's not in my family. Okay, Robbie, you gotta you gotta be a supportive, helpful sim. Um. Okay. Where? Uh, said birthing balls. You know, I don't really see those. And I don't think I saw them last time I was here either. Um, okay. You're calling on an exam. Go for a walk. I don't see anything about a birthing ball. Okay, go for a walk. And we teleported. Okay, go ahead and go pee, sir. And then I need you to grab some snacks. Some snacks. 
Vax. Gaia Vax. Let's get her and herself a sandwich. And it's coming out of R. So you know what? We're only going to get one. <laughs> We're only going to get one. Pregnant in labor. It's go time. Whoa. Ella's water just broke and a huge amount of water came out. For a second, Ella thought she had peed herself. Okay, you are not eating that, though. Do you have it on you? Where is the sandwich? You didn't get it yet. Bam, you're not eating it. <gasps> it disappeared? I am too freaking poor to let a sandwich just dis a freaking peer. What the heck? Alright, go play a video game. And then we'll have them check you after your fun goes up a little bit. We're gonna have to eat though. So sweet that he's hanging out with her. Dislikes easy listening. Okay. Okay, I can vibe with that. All right, it's 4 a.m. Can we ask to have our shit checked by the handsome red-headed doctor? The handsome red-headed one. Did you ask him? No, you just sat there. Oh, she's really having some, uh... Oh, he is right there. Boom 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 When did we get here? Because I don't remember. I do not recall. She's like, man, I haven't been in this nice of days. Since I went to my ex's house and dealt with him. Notice how she didn't even try. Three. Oh, honey, where's your pants? All right, sleep. Sleep. What are you up to, dude? Why don't you take a nap? Because, yeah, it's going to be a while. No, take a nap. There's something preventing you from taking a nap, huh? Is there a better spot for taking a nap? Where are you off to now? Buy a snack. Okay, I can vibe with that. You slept real freaking good in the hospital bed. She is going to be too broke to feed this child. Her fun is just completely going down because... Is there anything else that she can do here? Let's watch a movie with... Why is her fun still plummeting? All right, let's go get that up a girl. Well, our good doctor is gone. Okay, Manuel, it's your turn, sir. Give her that epidural. boy. <laughs> Oh. 
Does anybody see a birthing ball anywhere in this hospital? I see no such thing, but I might be coming up here to um, have the baby kind of in a seclusion, you know what I mean? What? Oh no. Where's he at? Five, we're halfway. Oh, Slarini Pombo, Hargrib Sekalau, Gifla Pashushi. Still not working for it, is it? So all she can do is walk, because I don't see birthing balls anywhere in the hospital. Is there a shower anywhere in this hospital? What? <sighs> yeah, this is a super realistic birthing mod, I would say. But she has to get out of this room with that. Because our fun's gonna just drop. But if I fucking make her go somewhere else, she might drop the food she paid for. Get your food! You just paid for it. We're broke as a joke. Like, we are freaking broke. Go sit here. <gasps> She's not going to eat it. No. Oh my god, it just disappears. Oh my god. <laughs> She's so poor. She's not even going to be able to get food. Oh my god. And she's only halfway to 10 centimeters. Oh. Oh, 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 okay. Okay. Alright. And now we're in business. Okay. You're gonna have to just buy a snack, I guess, and sit here and eat it in absolute agony listening to music that you hate. Fine. 
If this girl has twins, I swear I will absolutely lose my mind. Oh my god. I'm literally having your child and you're not even here. I'm having a baby right now. Dude. Yeah, music that you hate. I get it. I get it. I get it. I really cannot help you. I'm gonna let her have a sleep, and then from there, I guess, um, we'll check her dilation again. It's been like 12 hours since we were three centimeters dilated, so. Down out of there and go upstairs. The flamo, the Brithna Jafondra. Oh, uh huh. Abu. Oh my god. That's crazy. Wow. <laughs> This is like taking forever. Robbie's like, oh my god, I'm going to die. I'm going to just die. Why did I? Agree to this. <laughs> At the 17 year old girl having a baby by herself. Is there anything we can eat up here? No. Don't want to send her down where she hates the music. Oh my god. We just got her fun up. So I do like this mod, however I think that it would be better for long lifespan. So when you think about it, she's spending like such a high percentage of her time here doing this, you know, and Good idea going out for some fresh air. <laughs> it's almost time. The baby's ready to come out. Ella's trying as hard to focus on rhythm freedom, but the pain is becoming more and more unbearable and I'm starting to doubt whether she can do this. So does that mean if we check, we might be ready? Okay, girl. You're still listening. Why are you in here? You are fully dilated. Talk to one of our obstetricians to go into labor right away. What if I want him to deliver it? Because he's been taking care of me. I guess we're getting this old lady. Or not. Oh. 
Oh yay, he's doing it. Where's Robbie? Wait, 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 Robbie, Robbie, Robbie. Come here. Come here, go. Tata. Save him, Revobe. Well, she's fully broken out from this whole experience. Shocker, right? Robbie might be missing it. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Can he, like, I thought, maybe because he's not. <laughs> he's panicking? Can he, like, he can't do anything? Doc is pumping her up. Wait, is he doing anything? Oh, he is! He made it! He made it! I'm gonna cry! I haven't even gotten all that attached to her yet. But this is like so cute. He made it. Her dad isn't here, but he made it. Oh my god. Sibrin. Just of Wef. Watani Cha. Sigluna tweet. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. I should have gave him his makeover before this, but you know. Oh. Baby girl. I have no idea her name. She's Ella. Um. I have seen none that have struck my fancy. Smile, Grace, Mercedes, Harper. Claire? Claire Moon? That sounds nice. <gasps> Look at that. He's showing me here. Of course, with the... Oh, oh Robbie. Robbie is here for the whole thing. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh, How adorable. Like, literally, they were here all weekend. But. Oh, so, I really did enjoy the physical aspects of that. And, um. The animations and whatnot. But, like I said, on short or regular lifespans, that's gonna, like, eat out. A very large portion of their lives. Um, let's remove you from the family. I don't know if he would have done all of this if um, I hadn't added him to the family. That'd be something I'd have to play around with. 
can you go home? Or we just head home now? Christine, I can't believe that happened. She said, hey, yo, I, I totally just had a baby. And Christine's like, I can't believe that happened. Anyway, it was nice to talk to you. I'll see you at school. <laughs> that is hilarious. Now we have to see how long it takes Robbie to initiate coming over again. I don't, I don't know. Do we have chickens, apparently? Um... Because I deleted a bunch of stuff from the house, and it had farm animals. And apparently they went into the inventory. I don't know, this this has been kind of wonky from the start for some reason. Like, I think she already had... Oh, where's my baby? Whoa, she's in the wall, y'all. She's in the wall, y'all. She's in the wall. I don't know if she's going to be able to get to her like that. Let's see. I'll give her a good breastfeeding. She's very inspired after giving birth to her baby. Sweet, and she can reach her and everything. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Um... Let's just do a classic medium, because... I did give her, I think, level 3 painting. Wait! How does she have all these other skills? Did I randomize them? Oh my god! How is this so messed up? I mean... Programming level six, writing level six, guitar level five, charisma five. Uh, I honestly don't understand. Now, this sim was inspired by a previous. Sims. And I edited it in, like, edited her drastically. And I thought I cleared everything. And then I had her saved in the altered form, and then I altered her again for this. And I guess somewhere along the line, dive for ingredients? Why? Why ingredients? Why not dive for deals? A glow orb? Wonderful. I don't know. I mean, a teenage sim is not going to start out with absolutely zero skills. It's just not very realistic. But having that many skills? Uh, it's a little... It's a little iffy. Let's see if we can get her the baby in the photo. Oh my. Oh my god, she's gonna paint your baby. That is so cute. We are very hungry though. I might end up putting the simple living challenge back on. Um, I think early on it was just ridiculous to, you know, not even allow her to have a quick meal. Um, but yeah, we are going to have to go back to school tomorrow. Um, so we need to do our homework. The house looks fairly decent from that wall. It's a decent wall. I think I think the bedroom's the most screwed up room of the house. Honestly, so I think I'm gonna leave this here and 
We have 820 simoleons. We're soon enough going to have a toddler. Um, and yeah, that is going to take some money. Um, I think we'll get the rest of this stuff cleaned up and maybe get her a vacuum cleaner. And I hate that, but being that we're playing in this grunge format, <laughs> I think it's reasonable to have to do that. Um, we have our first decoration in our house. It does we sweet baby. Yeah. Um Yeah, so we'll pick this up and the next episode do a little bit more to the house. I'm gonna try to get rid of that persistent spider web. Um and maybe we'll see about getting a chicken coop for the chickens that we have in our inventory currently. Um, I don't think you can put them out without the coop. So that's kind of annoying. Um, we will see what we can do with that. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you at the next one.